Hey guys, so this is another video about Bitcoin hardware at CES 2014. Today we'll be looking at a Bitcoin hardware wallet. This revolutionary device might change how you think about Bitcoins. This pocket sized device can store, send, and receive Bitcoins. It also has many security and convenience benefits. However, there's something very subtle about this device that you may not like. And that is the fact that this machine is produced by Butterfly Labs. Now I don't know about you, but I've talked to a lot of people and not one person has said anything good about Butterfly Labs. In fact, there's even a thread on BitcoinTalk.org that has 146 pages of people just complaining about Butterfly Labs. There was even a poll for the least reliable ASIC company and Butterfly Labs came in first. It seems like it didn't matter how many people complained though because they're still a very successful company to this day. Successful enough that they were actually able to make the first, I think, Bitcoin hardware wallets out there. I mean, just look at how many Bitcoins this Bitcoin hardware example has. 42 Bitcoins. That means it has $42,000 in it. Actually, I spoke a little bit too soon because this machine actually has 480 Bitcoins in it. Nonetheless though, this is a revolutionary device. I mean, this machine's entire purpose is just for storing Bitcoins and transferring Bitcoins out. The fact that it can also receive Bitcoins and show you QR code and scan QR code, that just makes it all the more revolutionary. This is definitely the way to go if you want to make Bitcoin more accessible to the public. However, there is a con. If you lose your device, you can't get it back. Your Bitcoins are gone forever. So that's one risk. And everyone knows what this thing will look like. Like today's method, you would store into a random USB flash drive as cold storage. No one knows which hard drive has what, so you have a little bit of protection in that. If everyone knows that you have one of these things, they know where you store your Bitcoins. So that if someone steals it, well, there you go. But hopefully there's a way to like password protect your device or something so that it won't get hacked so easily. But anyway, that's pretty much it you guys. We'll most likely be seeing more of this device in the future.